Yeah, Spencer, right after the win, I saw you, I heard you say, wasn't clean, but uh, we got the job done. Just knowing that you'll need to play better still, how much are you guys able to kind of celebrate this moment and enjoy it? Yeah, um, you know, it's hard to win, and no matter what team you're playing, um, you know, that, that's a good football team we just played. Um, a lot of athletes on both sides of the ball, you know, they cause some havoc, do a lot of stuff on defense, but... You know, we found a way, uh, you know, scored 38 points, found a way, you know, had had really good numbers, um, you know, as a total offense and, you know, protected the ball, you know, one turnover. But, you know, we can clean that up. Um, overall, I feel like found a way. I'm happy with the win. A win is a win, man. Hey, Spencer, describe what it felt like to have that defense show up like it did. Three turnovers, I think, in mm -hmm. the uh, fourth quarter. Obviously, the pick six. What did that? What was that like for you? You know, it's awesome. It's complimentary ball. You know, I talked about it before. Defense, I think, had four takeaways today. It makes our job a lot easier. You know, now we need to be better when they get us a takeaway and going down and scoring, uh, you know, make, make the game not as close. But they did a great job today. They battled. Coach Beamer was kind of talking about you guys, um, you know, we're breaking it down on the uh, dancing in the locker room. Who had the best dance moves out there? I don't know. <laughs> came in the elite, so I ain't get to see her. But yeah. I think uh, Beamer had some good moves in there. You'll, yeah. you'll see it, you know. Yeah. T. Rob, few of the guys. Yeah, and then you know Beamer was kind of talking about you guys were lacking a little bit of energy. It seemed in the first half. I gotta ask, what kind of changed for you? I mean, obviously the defense stepped up and stuff. You guys played really good offensively, but what kind of just changed with the energy in the second half? I think we just uh, you know made some big plays. We're more consistent in the run game. Um, you know, just really put it all together. I feel like still, you know, didn't do everything great, but found a way in that second half. We wanted to win the fourth quarter of this game, and that's our that's our focus, and we did. So, Xavier, um, you've obviously been dealing with injuries and stuff. What did it mean to have a game like this, and why were you able to be so effective today? Oh, man, I had to make up for the last two games, man. Uh, I felt like uh, I, I didn't play my best ball. And I felt like today, y'all, I felt like I was 100%. So I had to go out there and ball. Spencer, today you went uh, over 10,000 career passing yards. Just, you know, kind of thinking about your journey and the path. Luckily, it ended in a win to get A. But, you know, what does that mean for you? You know, it means a lot. You know, that's, that's a um, – somebody let me – I think one of the announcers told me, hey, you need like 260 to get 10,000 passing yards uh, career uh, before the game. And – you know, I was kind of like, damn, why'd you have to tell me that, man? Like, but uh, yeah, man, I'm, you know, proud of myself, but, you know, proud of the team for obviously helping, you know, me. It's not just me. You know, Leggett made so many big plays, went for 217. That helped a lot. And O-line blocked their butts off today, had all day to throw the ball. And, you know, we made big plays, had a lot of explosives. So that makes it easy. Spencer, that guy sitting next to you, um, what, what does it mean to you, especially like, say, the other team? They make, they score, and you have Xavier's that deep threat, and you can come right back, and it's like in a blink of an eye, mm -hmm. boom, you got the lead back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a good feeling, you know. Um, Dow does a great job dialing him up. Um, you know, he showed up big time today, and, uh, you know, just a freak, man. He put it up, he's going to go score. So, you know, he puts the work in every day at practice, and it shows up on game day. So, can rely on him no matter what. Uh, Spencer, I was late in the game, uh, really tight. You guys were pretty big favorites going into it. And sometimes in those situations, there's a tendency to maybe overthink things or, or, or be really tight. Um, how did you guys kind of get out of that and break out of that and be able to make the plays needed to avoid dropping this game? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Uh, you know, it seems like, you know, these games that you're, you're favorited in, it's always, it's always a dogfight. You know, it's never an easy win, you know, no matter who you play. I mean, we've seen that over the past two years. And, you know, we just, like I said, we found a way, uh, made enough plays to win the game. Defense did a great job getting the ball back. And like you said, we made those plays in the time we needed them. And, uh, you know, happy with the win. You're talking about the guy next to you. Uh, Steve was saying he was 16 yards short of a uh, record. What the heck, Spencer? You couldn't get into him one more time? <laughs> yeah, that one I uh, – the PI, I should have let it go. It slipped out of my hand. It was a duck. That would have been another touchdown and another 60 yards for him. So, you know, we'll, we'll make up for it these last three. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can hear you. 
uh, I guess for, for both of you guys, um, there was the, the punt or whatever where Xavier, you like ran into the guy and I saw Coach Lembo kind of, you know, going into you a little bit. But right after that, Spencer, you go to him. Um, you did that for Nick uh, a couple weeks ago. Xavier, what did that mean? Like when he goes back to you that moment, you can make up for it. And then Spencer, is that kind of in your head to want to do that for your teammates? Oh, man, well, on the punt, man, I just got to be smarter on that, man. Uh, Coach Limbo, he, he coaches that every day, man. Uh, I just had a brain for it. <laughs> yeah, and, you know, like you said, you know, he, he's a smart player. He knows what to do. Um, whenever guys need to, you know, to get picked up, you know, as a leader, you want to go over there and pick him up. But, you know, with him, you don't really have to say much. He's going he's gonna to show back up and, and make a big play. Go cool, last one. Uh, Spencer, at home, you've just been incredible throwing the football. I think you had 11 incompletions at home before today and you had a good day today. So um, what is it about playing here and what kind of hope does that give the team and the fans knowing you got three more home games and the way you guys are kind of locked in in the passing game at home? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's funny. I mean, you look at our away stats compared to our home stats, it's crazy. Um, but, you know, I wish we could have done that in the away games. You know, we would have had a lot more better outcomes out of those three away games. But, you know, that's in the past. And we just got We got four, uh, three more games at home. I mean, the, the fan base, the energy they bring, it helps us a lot. You know, we're just, you know, guys are dialed in, um, you know, and we practice great every week. And we just got to got to have three more strong weeks. You know, that's it. So that's our focus. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it, y'all.